All right, so this is a Hardee's review. In this bag, we have the Superstar with cheese. Cue the intro. What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. All right, so here we go. Even says it on the wrapper. M&M. &M. I'm feeling lazy today. We're just going with M&M. &M. Uh, but Superstar with cheese. Let's check it out. All right, check it out right there. This is the Superstar with cheese. You're going to have two charbroiled beef patties, two slices of American cheese, lettuce, tomato, and sliced onions, dill pickle, special sauce, all underneath a toasted sesame seed bun. So this is basically the kitchen sink double cheeseburger. All of the regular uh, toppings you should find, normally find on just like a basic cheeseburger, except the fact that you're going to have that special sauce. So let me show it to you upside down. The more you turn me inside out and round and round. This was $6.49. It is a huge burger. This is part of their new uh, char broiled star line that Hardy's launched, I think back in March or April. There were six new uh, burgers. I reviewed the big Hardy. I reviewed the spicy Western bacon. And now we're going to try out one of the other new ones. This is the superstar with cheese. This thing is huge. They got like a whole garden on the bottom of it right there. Check it out one more time. All right, here we go. Let's go. Oh. Hmm. Mm hmm. Whoa. All right, so let's say this right off the bat. This is not a dry burger. I've had on occasion a dry burger experience uh, from Hardee's, but there's so much going on with this that I think it's almost impossible to be dry. The nice uh, addition of that special sauce. You know, I can't really explain that special sauce because a lot of these places put out these special sauces that are similar to Mac sauce, similar to Chick-fil-A sauce. You know what I'm getting at. It's basically a combination of mayonnaise, ketchup, a Thousand Island dressing, something along those lines. But I like it. Don't get me wrong. It adds a nice little flavor to the sandwich. And I'm glad I'm using the uh, burger diaper. I think Paul from Critical Each Japan coined that phrase. But I'm glad I'm keeping it on because this is a messy uh, situation. Second bite. All right, so listen. I think the price is a little high for this. I get it. There's two patties and there is a lot going on. It is freshly made. It tastes fresh. All of the vegetables look fresh. Check them out right there. And you know, I'm not a huge fan of tomatoes. These will be coming off as soon as I finish the third bite and this video. But I mean, I like this. This is a prototypical, well-made double cheeseburger with all of the accoutrement. But they put the accoutrement on the bottom. I got a little pickle in that uh, last bite and I liked it. So... Final bite. Culver's making an appearance. If you missed my last video, the uh, Culver's Poutine Burger, the Poutine uh, Butter Burger, definitely check that out. It will be linked uh, at the end of this video. But um, yeah, a prototypical, very well-made double cheeseburger. American cheese, all of the uh, toppings, I liked it. Let's give it a rating. On a scale of 1 to 100, with 1 meaning don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of... I'm going to give the brand new Superstar with Cheese burger from Hardee's a rating of... It's good. A little messy. A lot going on. Fresh. Solid. 80... Seven. I'm going to go 87. I enjoy it, but Hardee's is not usually my go-to for burgers. Like I said, it's been hit or miss with the burgers. This was a hit, uh, but I'm not 100% on board with the flavor of a Hardee's burger over a lot of the other chains out there. But that was a well-made double cheese burger. So uh, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget... Subscribe. Subscribe. There's a B in that word. There's a B in that word. Like, comment, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media, getting the word of my channel out to the masses. In closing, so what is that? Two of the six uh, new charbroiled stars, uh, the lineup that they launched. I did two of those. And um, 
Not sure I'll be trying any of the others. It is what it is. All right, bonus footage, like I said, Culver's. I don't care. Culver's making another appearance in a uh, video about a Hardee's burger.